Welcome back to the classroom. Our contestant, Delania Martinez. Had a lot of money and gave it back, but now we are on the uphill climb again. You got $5,000. You still have your peak left. You still have $9,000 on the board. Four subjects, pick one. Literature. Literature. Fifth grade literature. All right, Delaney, a correct answer could double your winnings. Here is the fifth grade question. What 1850 novel by Nathaniel Hawthorne tells the story of Hester Prynne and Arthur Dimsdale? What 1850 novel by Nathaniel Hawthorne tells the story of Hester Prynne and Arthur Dimsdale? All right, Kevin's locked in his answer. I think I think I know this one. You know, I don't know the lower grade stuff, but I know the upper grade stuff somehow. I'm gonna go with the Scarlet Letter. Locking it in. Did you have to read the Scarlet Letter in school? Yes. I remember having to read the Scarlet Letter. Do you remember what the letter was? What letter it was? Oh, it was an A. It was an A, Absolutely. right. And you got an A on this question, because you were absolutely right. Look at this, you're all the way back up to $10,000. We got a first, second, and third grade question. Which one would you like? First grade math. First grade math, all right. For $500, riddle me this, Dr. D. If Kevin's dog Pete is 14 dog years old and one human year equals seven dog years, how many human years old is Pete? If Kevin's dog Pete is 14 dog years old and one human year equals seven dog years, how many human years old is Pete? All right, Kevin's dog Pete is 14 years old. My poor dog is 14 human years old, my poor pup. So 14 dog years old and one human year equals seven dog years is 14 divided by seven. I would say the human years old for Pete is two and I'm gonna lock that in. What's your dog's name? Buffy. Buffy may be an old lady, but her master has a lot of money, because you are absolutely right. <laughs> it is two. <laughs> 14 divided by seven. <laughs> Down to two, second grade art, third grade US geography. Geography. Third grade US geography. Third grade questions are worth $2,500. Here's this one. Mount Vernon, the home of US President George Washington, is located in what state? Mount Vernon, the home of US President George Washington, is located in what state? All right, Kevin's locked in his answer. See, I'm getting confused now because Mount Vernon is on the other side of the water, which is Maryland. But I thought the first Mount Vernon was in Virginia. Okay, well, you have a peak left, okay? Mm -hmm. You can't take the cheats with you. I think I am gonna peak. Okay, What's you wanna peak? lock that in? Yeah. Oh, yes. One peak, okay. <laughs> take a look at the board. Kevin said he thinks Mount Vernon is in Virginia. I am going to uh, go with Kevin's answer. I'm going with Virginia. Let's go for it, Kevin. It is on the other side of the water. And it is in Virginia, you're absolutely right. 